everybody anyway. Anyone to think my store was in quarantine the way people seem to keep away from it. Son of a gun, it's a gall darn shame, that's what it is. <laughs> Squeeze. 
Your usual table? This way, please. Thanks, Henri. Be right with you, honey. Check your hat, Mr. Swain. Hiya, babe. Joe, how about giving Joe a sample of 
for that final drink. Oh, ha, 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 ha. First old please, ha, the best, ha, 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 ha. That's the rain that does the most good. And it falls right over the good soil area. Well, I'll be darned. And now for the best sunshine. soil in the finest green area. Right, Joe. And where all three overlap is the spot Stokely's picked to grow their finest. So that's where they built their cannery. Gee, do they only have one cannery easy? Only one? Why, Stokely has canneries everywhere. Up in Canada, all over the United States, and even across the Blue Pacific and Hawaii. But let's get down to Earth, Joe. I want to show you one of Stokely's finest growing areas. Gosh, Easy, they're beautiful. And you know why? Good breeding, Joe. Good breeding. Let me show you. The family album. You know, Joe, Stokely's tomatoes aren't just plain tomatoes. Well, what are they? They're pedigree. Hey, she's a cute little tomato. Uh-huh. That's Miss Lambert, a tasty dish. And that's Mr. Bolgino. I uh, sort of introduced them, and <laughs> it was love at first sight. You know, wedding bells and orange blossoms and... <laughs> uh, there? Uh-huh. Little Van Camp. And that's Senorita Tomato from South America. I uh, introduced them, too, and... They were married? Uh-huh. And did they, uh... Uh-huh. Jeepers, that's quite a family. Yes, sir. Stokely's family of tomatoes has a pedigree that's 30 years old. Gosh, easy. After all that trouble, these tomatoes must be perfect for canning. They are. But only the finest of these are sent to Stokely. And it doesn't stop there, Joe. Why, within one hour after they're picked, they start on their way through the canneries. The first step is a plunge into a pool of fresh water. And that's us they go. Next, a real golden shower. Now we're ready for a rigid inspection. Only the juiciest and healthiest pass the test. Then these choice specimens get a nice hot bath. Hot enough to make them peel off their clothes. Joe! 
got Sam Hilda going on in here. Uh, we're, we're, we're getting off to a fresh start, Mr. Puddle, with a complete line of Stokely's finest product. But, but uh, what do you mean by... Now, 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 don't get excited, Mr. Puddle. I I'll let Easy explain. Easy? Who's Easy? That's me! Joe's right, Mr. Funnel. He's found out what's wrong. That's why he's putting in a new line. But I can't afford it. <laughs> Don't worry. Joe's taking care of that part. <laughs> I told you I had some money saved up. Yeah, you shouldn't have done it, Joe. It's no gamble. It's a sound investment. A Stokely display will always pay. <laughs> Easy said it. A Stokely display will always pay. Always pay. Yes, always pay. A Stokely display will always pay. Do it the easy way. way. Why, look. My store. It's, it's, it's beautiful. Joe, my boy, I believe you're right. You've got something. <laughs> you bet, Mr. Fuddle, we've got Stokely's finest. And look at those swell Van Camp Profit products, too. Van Camp beans, tenderoni, chili con carne, and lots of other surefire items. They're real money makers that thousands of folks eat, eat, and enjoy. I'm with you, son. Yes, sir, Rebob. You're doggone tootin'. I'm gonna tell him about the good news. Uh, but, but easy. Little supermarket. Uh, hello, Ann. What? Uh, you can't, Ann. No. Now! 
congratulate us, Pop. Pep, congratulate you? <laughs> How about somebody congratulating me? <laughs> I think we all ought to congratulate Easy. <laughs> Shucks. That was nothing. I told you, Stokely's finest never fails. Always remember, if you want to come out on top, Easy does it. When you're blue, easy does it, easy does it, easy does it all for you. When in trouble.